At the front of the eye is the pupil, which is a hole which lets light through. But if you lean forward, the aqueous humor, which is a fluid just behind it, doesn't drain out because the cornea is coating it, which is a glassy front of the eye. Surrounding the pupil is the colored part of the eye, known as the iris, which helps regulate the amount of light entering the eye. If there's bright light, the iris closes the pupil to let in less light, and when there is low light, the iris opens up the pupil to let in more light. The sclera is the white outer coat of the eye surrounding the iris. The ciliary body is the structure in the eye that secretes aqueous humour, the clear fluid that fills the front of the eye. The ciliary body also contains the ciliary muscle, which changes the shape of the lens when the eye focuses on an object. It lies just behind the iris. The retina is the nerve layer lining the back of the eye. The retina senses light and creates electrical impulses that are sent through the optic nerve to the brain. Not shown is the macula, which is a special part of the retina that contains light-sensitive cells. In the macula, these light-sensitive cells allow us to see fine details clearly in the centre of our visual field. The deterioration of the macula is a common condition as we age. The fovea is the centre of the macula, which provides the sharpest vision. The nerve cells of the retina bundle up into the optic nerve, which then travels to the back of the brain.